Hello everybody, I'm Colorful Artie and welcome back to Freddy Fish and Woofer's Maze Madness. Well, kind of Freddy Fish and Woofer's Maze Madness. So I completed this game I am as a Let's Play a while ago, but apparently there was a user out there named Almighty Mandals who saw my secret level editor tutorial and actually made his own level pack of Hi, custom levels I'm in Freddy Maze Madness. Um, yeah, Freddy. Whatever. So I will be playing through those. I've actually wanted to play a Maze Madness like custom level pack for a while now. And I finally get the chance to do it. I'm super pumped. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's been basically messaging me on Twitter uh, wondering like, Hey, would you be up for doing like, let's play in this? I'm like, heck yeah, I would. So here we are. So this is, uh, the tentative name is Mandel's Maze Mayhem. This is a level pack of all 50 levels that have all been replaced. And he has said that, uh, much like the original game, there's a bonus level at every five levels. And also he's, he said it has, it doesn't reach Kaiser levels of difficulty, which is good. He said that he's thoroughly tested it and that it can, it can be played and beaten without using the Junior Helper. I'm gonna try to do as much as I can without the Junior Helper, but... The vanilla game itself already kind of kicked my butt, and I had to turn on the junior helper at the end. So no promises that I'll do the whole thing without it. But I'm super pumped to start. This is going to be a lot of fun. So he is... He's replaced all the levels with his own custom versions, and... Apparently the worlds are no longer in order, and I'm not even sure if the worlds will even be the same. I, I have a list of the worlds here. The first five levels are known as Lavender Lair. So, just so everyone can see, those are both off. <laughs> oh boy. This is gonna be fun. Let's get started with this Maze Madness custom pack right now. We better get swimming and collect all those kelp seeds. All right, so level one, it looks like we're going to the coral reef already and <laughs> we've got the anglerfish already. Okay, so this is single room level to start. That's good. Wow, this is, <laughs> thank you Mandels. This is a significantly less sadistic first level than the one I made as my first level in my, like, 10 level pack. Okay. But we had the same idea, put the anglerfish all over the place. So we got two different gates to open, it doesn't matter which one we open first, so yeah, cool. I'm gonna try to get all the bonus stuff. I at least want to enter every single bonus level, that would be really nice. I want to- I want to explore the whole pack. I want to see everything that Mandel's put into this. Woo! Birthday cake. Thank you for putting in these bonus point values here. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Good job with the Coral Reef set as well. I, I, this one, Some of the sets are pretty tough to work with. Oh, whoops. I left the kelp seed back at the beginning. Oh well. This is off to a great start. <laughs> uh, I've tried working with a lot of the sets, and the Coral Reef set is the hard, one of the hardest ones to work with, especially since you have these like, pieces that you can swim through. That's part of, like, the background set, not the foreground <laughs> set. It, it, it can be tricky to work with in the editor, but it looks really nice. Also, you've got the light blue uh, sea background on, like, the dark blue one. That's always cool to see. Glad we're already seeing creativity with the level pack thus far. I think I'm gonna try to uh, keep it at five levels a video, so we'll do one world for every uh, uh, YouTube video. So this first episode might be pretty you short, but I don't want it to be like, oh, Artie, oh, yeah, I bet I, I bet I could do all ten levels in a video. That it's a two-hour video. Like, that would not be ideal. <laughs> the anglerfish are not that big of a deal. I actually like going up against the anglerfish. Ooh, nice. I'll leave that cozy <laughs> Never mind, I won't leave that Kelsey behind. <laughs> that was my own stupidity. Now I only have two peanut butter and jellyfish sandwiches. <laughs> I, I was so... What the, what the worm doodle? I bet I can make it. <laughs> nope. I'm gonna wait for him to go a little bit farther. Oh, hi. Uh, no, no, no. Nope. No goldfish here. Nope. That is your imagination, Mr. Anglerfish. I am on level 2 and I've already lost a life. This is going to be a great let's play, I think. You can swim under that, that is interesting. That very much looks solid, but I'm glad the blowfish was there to show me. No, it's not. Okay. You better get swimming and collect all those kelp seeds. <laughs> I'm really glad this, well, 
I'm pretty glad that this level pack starts you off slow and you only have, like, levels that are one room large. Well, I hope that's not what we had to do. No, no, I messed up. <laughs> I just realized, I'm like, oh, a boulder, I'll push it, blam! No, no, Artie, no. Don't you realize? <laughs> I like that, that's that's really nice. Okay, yeah, we're supposed to push it upwards. And this way we can get all the goodies. And you know how much I love goodies. Goodies are a wonderful thing. Oh, I want those pearls. My grandma left them for me. Not really. Alright, I'm glad to see we already have, like, optional bonus goodies that you have to be smart in order to get. <laughs> I appreciate that. I am not smart. <laughs> At least not in that context. I didn't think we would be experiencing those this early on in the pack. Alright. Yeah, what I'm learning is that when I make custom levels, I'm far more sadistic than most people. <laughs> because the first five levels I did in my pack were the sand tile set, and... Yeah, first level was one screen, but it was just filled with anglerfish. And by the end, there were all five screens. We yeah. better get swimming and collect all those help Also, I just wasn't very good at level design. I, I, would be, I would be like, oh, yeah, you enter a room from this direction, yeah, you instantly die. <laughs> Not even intentionally, literally just I didn't think. Alright, I'll leave that kelp seed for later. Whoosh. Blowfish, you don't scare me. You're the slowest enemy in the game. Actually, we gotta open the, both of those gates to get kelp seeds, so... Oh, I see. Oh, oh, I like... Oh no! That's bad! That's bad! <laughs> bad one! <laughs> oh, hi! Oh, this is cool! Oh, this, this is actually really cool, because those two anglerfish are synced up. And now we desync them by using that hinge. Oh, that's so cool! I'm already liking the creativity in this pack. This is great. Well done. Well done, Mandel. Whoosh! This is cool. I was wondering if we were gonna see, like, oh yeah, it's the Coral Reef levels, but they'd have different backgrounds for each level, because that's kind of what I did. We, we might see experience that in the future, who knows? Alright, last level of the first world, Lavender Lair. Okay. So we got one purple sea urchin, and there's only one purple sea urchin on this level, so we could go up. We're gonna eventually have to go up, but if we go to the left... Actually, wait a second. Oh, I don't think it e No, it doesn't even matter which way I go. Complete freedom to go the way I want. So they all hook up eventually at the end. Uh... Oh, I can't go... Dunk on it! They don't all hook up, like I thought they did. No, I missed out on a few shells, but that's okay. I'm perfectly happy with that. I don't plan on trying to get the best possible score. I just want to explore all the rooms and get goodies when I can. I also keep forgetting, I do have the bubble gum. Not bubble gum. I do have the bubble bath power up. Alright, that was really short, so actually, at least for this first video, Ready I'm gonna to do... Play? You can go ahead and choose the level you want to start Freddy on. Fish, I know, I know how to play. To I know how to level, play, Freddy. All you gotta do is click on mm, the yeah, we're gonna do the next five go levels, because these are a lot level, easier than I, what I was up, expecting. So, level six for ten are known as the, sh the Sandy the Shipwreck. Level. So let's... <laughs> oh, yeah, we're already at the pirate ship. And we've got the sand background. That's really cool. <laughs> that poor anglerfish. <laughs> Okay, uh, well, we're gonna have to push the boulder that way. And now we're experiencing multiple rooms. How about that? Pebble in the middle, okay. I'm gonna have to explore those whirlpools in more detail. Ha, wood! Alright. And we already have squid. The 
what a life, Squid. Okay, what a life indeed. I'm, I'm sorry, what the heck just happened there? What happened? Wait, what? That doesn't even make sense. I was holding up through the whole thing. I should have gone into that whirlpool there. It pushed me all the way into this whirlpool. And I didn't move up, but for some reason, then it knocked the pebble up. That's bizarre. <laughs> I don't know what to make of that. Oh, boy. That's right, they break on contact with the fish bones. No! No, come on! I want those pearls! <laughs> I, I sense a trend coming. Bam, bam, bam. Alright, let's try this again. Alright. Yeah. Yes, that's what we want. <laughs> Gotta give me those cool coins! <laughs> Don't melt! Oh, it melted. Oh, that's a, that's kind of <laughs> that's kind of strange. Uh, yeah, Mandel. One thing you should keep in mind is that uh, the, the 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 portals to the different rooms they take the form of that shape. So it looks just a little odd. Maybe change these from corner. Maybe change this and that from corner pieces to just side pieces. And that, that would make it look a little bit better. Just my opinion. Oh, the pirate flags. I always get, I always get excited when I see the pirate, the Jolly Rogers. Because then I'm like, oh, there's probably something hidden behind it. I'm a, su I'm a sucker for hidden stuff in games. Alright, so it looks like we can't destroy this fish bone. But if we distract this what a life squid, hey what a life, over here, what a life! Oh, this is really fun. I'm really happy to see the pirate ship as the second world because this is easily one of my favorite worlds in the game, mainly to do with that groovy music. All right, what a life squid, stop being a butt. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Don't guard the exit. I'll get through some way. Ooh, a firecracker. How dangerous. All right, <laughs> let him out. Get the heck out. Uh-oh, did I screw myself? <laughs> Probably should have had destroyed the fishbone before letting him out. This is just a comedy of errors, isn't this? Hey, what a life. <laughs> what did I do? You did a lot. Look at all those kelp seeds. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm only going to plan on doing five levels per video, but yeah, if I, if I can beat five levels in 10 minutes, I'm gonna try another five. Come on, actually, no. With all those fish, but wait. No, I didn't do that. this. Oh, you suck. And the bubble bath is as glitchy as ever. Oh, dog on it. Uh, interesting. Uh, yeah. It's gonna leave us alone. Cool, cool. This 
this means we want to shoot that downwards. Yes, what a squid! I do not like calamari. Oh. That happened. Hmm. Okay, so I screwed up again. I want- Oh, look at all those prizes, too! No, no, I want those prizes. <laughs> Maybe I won't get through ten levels in this video. But... I'm gonna try to keep each video around 20 minutes, I think. We better get swimming and collect <laughs> all those kelp! I screwed up. Worm doodles make it more risky. <laughs> As I was saying, it makes it a little more risky in order to push pebbles around. Harder to stop yourself. So if we push this this way, yeah. <laughs> Freddy, you, you forgot. The I got the sand dollar. I always, as a kid, I always thought that looked like a cookie. <laughs> Later, losers! Oh, that was so worth it. That was so worth going back for. Oh, come on. I want a game, like a Maze Madness game, where, where, with, that's hacked so that the Worm Duel lasts, like, way longer. Because the Worm Duel is not lasting nearly long enough. Okay, so it looks like all the World 1 levels were one room. The World 2 levels seem to be two rooms. Uh, hey! Hey! <laughs> you causing some trouble in my neighborhood? No! <laughs> Push the wrong key. Well, there goes the extra sandwich I got. Oh well. <laughs> Still enjoying this world. Ah, uh, here you go, Freddy. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna want to push that boulder to the left. Oh. Now I only have two. Okay, I'm calling bull on that one. That that's that's a jerk move there. <laughs> How was I supposed to know that that would end up over there? All right, well let's try something else then. <laughs> That's cool. I do. I do like that. Boy, how does it get my ends? Because I get my heart rate up. But that was still well done. <laughs> I'm still calling bull on the squid portal, though. <laughs> it's not a very nice thing to do. We're in the sandy shipwreck today. Sandy shipwreck, sandy ship, sandy shipwreck all day long. Hey, what a life. Well, I have died like three or four times, and I'm not even a fifth of the way through the game. <laughs> Oh boy, more fun with whirlpools. I'm noticing Mandel really likes the whirlpools. Okay. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I probably already screwed up, didn't I? I picked up that kelp seed. Nope, never mind. Alright, so there's gonna be one... So 
because there's a starfish over there. We need a starfish to get the starfish. That's fun. I already have bubble bath, so there's no point in getting that earlier than I need to. Oh, is this gonna hit all of them? That's fantastic. Okay, that first room wasn't nearly as bad as I expected. Nice job arranging the tiles, all things considered. I, the pirate ship was looking very nice. Obviously, we're gonna use one of our starfish to get in here. That's just a duh. Gotcha. <laughs> this is a classic trick I love using. It. I'm pushed down! I need bigger keys on my keyboard. Oh no, I'm about to have a game over in the second world. Alright, well last level of the Sandy Shipwreck, let's see what's up ahead. <laughs> it's wow, more fish bones. Help, these are everywhere. I should I should <laughs> I should record videos of the levels that I made. <laughs> Just to have someone who's like, wow, Artie, you are a sadist. Okay, so clearly we've gotta push this pebble first and then that pebble. I just realized I missed the first bonus level. How did I even miss that? Okay, no, 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 no. Before we continue with that, we're going back. I know it's too late, and, like, I'm not getting any points for it. But I don't care. How did I miss the crack there? I'm such a moron. Come on, Freddy, swim up. <laughs> swim up to Oh, yeah. I, I bet I know where the scepter's gonna spawn. Just as I thought. How did I even miss the crack? It's probably because there are a lot of... so stupid! <laughs> I hope people are enjoying watching me fail utterly at everything I do. Because I know I'm enjoying it! Thanks for the extra sandwich that I don't I have any use for now because it's on replay. Oh, this place looks beautiful. Good job putting the gold and stuff in there. I can't believe I even at the very beginning of the video I said every five levels there is a bonus video out there. There's a bonus video. I'm gonna get it. And then I immediately forget. And that was only a few minutes after I said that, so no excuse. Everyone, fill the comment section saying party is a idiot. Wow. <laughs> this is the start of a fantastic Let's Play. The only- th that, is, that wasn't even the design itself. That was 100% utterly, entirely on me. Oh wow, I'm stupid. <laughs> Oh, please. <laughs> this isn't even doing anything, because again, yeah, it's not really fun. But I don't care. I like... I like popping these guys. Also, if you put too many of them in, and you hit too many of them in a row, the score stops appearing. Like, it looks at a 25, 50, or like that. Alright. Didn't have any effect on my actual gameplay, I just wanted to make sure that that could shut off. Because I- <laughs> because I noticed, uh, 
Might, it might have been in the next room. I noticed there was a crack. In, or no, I noticed the crack in the wall there. And I'm like, oh yeah, I, we have to like destroy those because that's where the bonus room is. And as soon as I was thinking that, I'm like, I forgot about the bonus level in the first world. <laughs> that is not... <laughs> well, you know, at least that'll be entertaining, won't it? Because <laughs> all things considered, this is, this is a really well done level pack. Holy cow. Granted, I'm, I've only experienced at this point, uh, 20% of it. Actually, wow, I've already experienced 20% of it. Holy cow. Move it, squids. I don't have time for your life. Oh, look at that butt squid. He's just following me. I have a bubble bath. Fear me. Okay, well... Obvious start. That's the only thing that can be used from that pebble. Alright. I do like these fishbone whirlpool puzzles. They're cool. As long as I can kind of suss together which way they go. Um, that pebble cannot be used for anything. Oh, you... You see what's going on over there. That's totally what's gonna spawn the staff. Or maybe not. Maybe not. Darn it. Oh, there's nothing there. Well, I've got bubble bath! <laughs> I'm coming! Don't leave me behind! Oh, are the final levels uh, always going to be used for the bonus rooms, I wonder? It would actually kind of make sense, because they're the trigger rooms. But, also, it's got the creepy music. Because <laughs> the, the music, for those of you who didn't see my custom level editing tutorial, which is probably not many, um, the music for the level that you're playing, or the room, rather, is determined entirely on what type of terrain is used in the upper left corner. So if you use a piece from the last level tile set in the upper left corner, even if every other tile is from a different tile set, it will play the last level music, which is incredibly creepy. Boits. I love points. <laughs> I didn't get enough of them in World 1. And looking back, I'm even like, oh, no, I missed the, uh, just a couple of shells in the first world, but that's I don't care about a few shells. And, uh, hindsight is 20, 20 and it kicks you, uh, kicks you in the gut. <laughs> I need to stop beating myself while I'm all over that. <laughs> Unless people like me seem to do that. I'm more just like, <laughs> how is it after the span of, like, Ten minutes tops, I already forgot about what I said. Alright, give me my cotton candy. We're gonna get the other sand dollar. <laughs> that little thing right there, it looks like you can swim through that, but you can't. It's one of the joys of the grid mist system. The whole Let's Play is just Artie plays a level pack and fails utterly. Although I haven't had a game over yet. How do I have three lives? I've died so much. I have died so much already. In worlds one and two. These are the warm-up worlds, just so people know. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm having a ton of fun playing this. Thank you so much, Mandel, for making this. This is going to be an awesome Let's Play. And thanks, everybody, for watching. Uh, if you want to download this and play it for yourself, I guess leave a comment. Uh, 
I'll see what I can do about that. You only need the HE8 file. And then just follow my tutorial and repl just replace the HE8 file on the actual copy of the game files. Copy the game files before replacing the HE8 you file, otherwise your CD will no I'm longer have Maze Madness on it. And it will be a very sad person. But I'm really pumped to continue this. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. And I hope to see you for the next video. We might do two worlds again. We might only do one world. We'll just have to wait and see. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.